welcome back. Each week we are joined by Hope Rises to share heartwarming stories and acts of charitable kindness. This morning we're introducing you to a truly remarkable woman who spent years training to walk down the aisle. We've got Kate Glazer from Hope Rises here with Kaylin to talk all about your incredible accomplishment. If you saw the video, you certainly cried. I know I did. I know Kate did. Yes. And the pictures are incredible. So first of all, congratulations on your wedding. Thank March you. of 2021, right? Yep. All right, so still newlyweds. Yep. What motivated you to train so hard for so long? So one of my biggest goals was uh, I always just want to be able to walk on my own. And I know that that's possible. But it also shows other people with cerebral palsy that anything is possible. And that's why it meant so much to me. It was so incredible. What was your husband's response when he saw you walking down the aisle toward him? Well, he definitely cried. <laughs> um, I was like crying and I was happy at the same time. So it was all these mixed emotions and then trying to stay focused <laughs> at the same time was, you know, exciting but hard. Yeah. So, and Look yeah. at that picture I mean, these pictures are gorgeous, aren't oh they? Gosh, so amazing. Yes. <laughs> Such a beautiful bride. Look at those muscles. Power pose. <laughs> Not just physically strong, but mentally strong as well. You and your husband make such a perfect couple. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So, Kate, tell us about this awesome feature that is uh, being done about Kaylin. Yeah. It's pretty exciting. So I was so honored to be there for her wedding day. Kaylin had asked me to yeah, be there to yeah. kind of help document her walking down the aisle for the first time to her to her husband. And we actually, she was featured in Women's Day magazine. We have a full page, full six page spread in this, this month's edition. And she was one of the featured stories locally from Western New York. And mm -hmm. the magazine editor said, we have to have more stories like Kaylin in this world that people can get through anything that is challenging them or what they're up against and she came out full force you trained for a year right a year to do this yeah um totally i've been working with my personal trainer for four years wow yeah uh, the ultimate goal is to walk completely independent and only a couple people knew that you were training to do yes. this right was yeah. it hard to keep that a secret very uh, you know, I had asked my twin sister if she would walk me down the aisle. So, um, you know, she had to keep that a secret as well. So, and I even told my church that I have a big surprise for you on my wedding day. And I'm sure everybody was, was surprised. Yeah. And yeah. There was not a dry eye in that church. Oh it was gosh. just, everyone was so like surprised, but also yeah. just so happy for you that you could do this. And just to see Chris's emotion when you got down yeah. the aisle, his face was like just nothing like it. Oh my gosh, Kaylin, congratulations. I can't wait to read the story in the uh, in the magazine. Um, real fast, for people who want to find it, where can they find it? Yeah, it's on every Target, Wegmans, Tops. Go right in uh, Women's Day magazine. Um, Kaylin's one of our six uh, featured stories. She's one of our three local featured stories. So she's a hope hero. She's a hero to so many. And I'm just so grateful that she was included in this. Absolutely, Kaylin. It was an honor to meet you. You are Thank truly you. an inspiration. Thank you guys both so much for coming here thank today. you abby thank you all right it is 8 47 let's send it right on over to uh traffic with mike the